I got my beautiful backyard. I got my shade. I got my book. I got my lawn chair. I got my iced tea. And I got my kitty cat. Life is fucking perfect. I am shooting this video in the comfort of my own backyard because A, it is fucking gorgeous outside, and B, my family usually goes to the cottage on the weekends, but instead they decided to stay home. So now I have to deal with them and I don't want to film in front of them because they suck. So there's no clocks in the vicinity. So I'm sorry Jazzy that I can't do your challenge this week, but it was a great challenge and I can't wait to do it next week and it will be rad. Really will. Did I just say rad? Wow. So this week's theme is uh, list one thing that was on your bucket list that you already got to do. And one thing on your bucket list that is really, really important and that you have to do before you die but you haven't done yet. So, let's begin. I actually wrote a bucket list when I was like 14. And it had like like 22 things on it, I think. And a lot of them were like simple things like learn how to French braid, learn how to snap your fingers. Well, I can do it with this hand. Can't do it with that hand. I don't know why. Just can't. Um, learn how to blow a bubble with gum. And there are a bunch of more complex things, too, um, like travel to this place, meet this person, do this, accomplish this, have this. Um, so I got a lot to work with, so yeah. So I did learn how to blow a bubble with gum, so I can cross that off of my bucket list. But I think a more major thing that I got to do um, was I got to meet a famous celebrity. And that was when I was 15, because I got to make a wish, because I'm a crippled child. Yo, because I have a heart problem, and I have, like, heart shit, and it's very crappy. But anyway, so I got to go to L.A., and I got to go to the set of CSI New York, which, at the time, was my kids in the hall. It was, like, of my obsession, and I was in love with everything. And I got to meet all the writers, all the producers, all the directors. I got to meet uh, Melina Kanakaridis and Eddie Cahill. I got to watch filming. I got to take home a bunch of scripts that um, no fan had ever gotten before, so it was awesome. But I also got to meet Gary Sinise, and because he was in a bunch of really awesome famous movies in the 90s, he's like super famous, and also he's friends with Tom Hanks who's super famous, so that means he's super famous. So I'm gonna count that as my super famous person. So Gary Sinise, I got to meet you, and it was awesome. He was so nice, he was fantastic. So I'm on my arm. Another thing on my bucket list, was to save a life. And you see that kitty cat there, Chip? Hey, buddy. I love you. Yeah. He's my buddy. I love him and he loves me and we're awesome. We're best friends, aren't we, Chip? It's kind of sad. But anyway, I think on my bucket list was to save a life. And when I rescued Chip from certain death, i.e. euthanization, uh, because it was taken away from abusive owners, I saved his life. So yes, Chip, you? You're on my bucket list. You've been done. Woot. I fucking love that cat. Now there's a lot of stuff on my bucket list that I still haven't done. Um, most of it I still haven't done. Um, but I'm going to list the most important thing. I've always wanted to learn how to pilot an airplane because my grandfather built airplanes. My dad used to be a pilot so it kind of runs on the family. I also want to have fans either fans because I'm a comedian or fans because I became a writer but either way I want fans and lots of them lots and lots and lots of fans I've always been obsessed with like death my entire life like natural disasters airplane crashes train crashes um, murders uh, robberies uh, ghosts to uh, some degree and so something that was on my bucket list was to be in a natural disaster or be in something serious like this, like an airplane crash or something like that, and survive. And that's still kind of on my list because I think it would be really cool to uh, be a survivor. So yeah, I'm weird, very weird. So I've totally listed more than one each, so sorry about that guys.
the fedora of awesomeness challenge Jazzy, and so I challenge you to do your whole video with something heavy and large balanced on your head. So enjoy that. 